good morning um welcome back to my channel if you are new here my name is miss williams aka simone and it's a pleasure having you on my channel they're going to be using my tests i'm sorry my room for testing guys so i gotta figure out how to cover it up well not figure out i have the equipment um i'm here pretty early i should lock that door um gotta do a nice night in early 707 right now super early none of the kids are here except for like two of them um what did i do with the rest of the paper oh. i threw it away <laughs> um or we could just pull it down so that because we're not going to be doing nothing when we come back anyway it's already made just gonna be like cramming Oops. So we are the line. <laughs> yeah, we're just gonna be going over what we already know. So I'm gonna go ahead and pull those down. Kind of sit you in a nice good position. Hey y'all. I think I'm going to do it at the end of the day because it makes more sense. Yeah, I'll pull down the anchor jars and we'll just try to like put it back up so it can look decent. I think I'm going to pull them down at the end of the day because I really don't. I mean, they don't care like to do observations right now. But just in case they do, I uh, want to make sure that my is covered. So I'll leave it up for now. Um, that's that now. Next order of business, figuring out what the hell we're doing today. Um we started working on division and multiplication situations. I think we're just going to talk about financial literacy. And then um, when we come back into our rooms, because we're moving for STAR, then we will um, have a plan on going over the content we learned throughout the year. And y'all know I've been placed in math like January. January, February, March, April, May. Yep. Four months I've been in the LA, not since the school year started. So, we'll see. Anyways, let me show you my little outfit. I got that dress thrifting. Um, I got most of my teachers stuff thrifting. Got my lanyard from Amazon. Got one for me, one for my co-teacher. Um, this number one teacher thing, I got it from my parents. And yeah, that's what's going on. She's doing a nice quick little tour. This video is gonna be super short. Nice little tour. Um and um that'll be it. So class moves. I think I'm gonna save that for next year. I might. I think I want more of pastel colors. Um because I really didn't have an opportunity to design this room the way that I wanted because I came in late. And on top of that, y'all already know I don't have a design bone in my body, so when I tell you, um, <laughs> I wouldn't have known how to put it together. I'm serious. Like, um, when the year started, I was helping out the dual teacher with her room, but she kind of already had an idea of what she wanted. Also, like, there's a non-negotiable that goes into this situation. Like, you can't just come in and put things up wherever you want to. Last time you saw my class, it was single, like, set up for testing, and I'm going to have to put it back that way before um, the end of the day today. But... I kind of grouped them up because we were working on Mother's Day cards that ended up being, some of them were nice, some of them were just a disaster. Like, I gave this project to my class. And they did a splendid job. Like, I didn't even need to do anything extra. We didn't even use staples. We used um, glue. And I tried to make my class do it, my morning class, and it was a disaster. So when I went in the bin, it was just a whole bunch of flowers, but that's completely okay because one thing about me, I don't got a creative bone in my body and I'm not an art teacher, so I'm fine. Um, but I say, yeah, the desks are situated like this now. Got the small group table here. I don't really use this, but it's here. My chair's at the front. Sorry, right there. Uh -uh, because that's where I be for the most, like the majority of the day. I have um, manipulative corner that with their gold math books and um, what is it like stations or whatever. But my kids are my kids are messy. 
because they're babies. Oh, so they kind of put everything everywhere. But that's it. I'm gonna let them in because they're in my business, and we'll talk later. Very extreme. Because friends are chaperoning the lunch, the cafeteria now. Hey y'all, it's planning time, and today we are going to actually plan because I gotta get this stuff down. I'm wearing my um, veg like a handbag. It's actually recommended by one of my kids because of my um, new stomach piercing. So there's that. Just gotta take down everything here, cover that wall, um, and get those vocabulary words off of there. And I'm probably going to be filing some things. <laughs> Um, so I'm excited. So let's uh, sit you down so we can get things down. Y'all need some anchor charts? Holla at your girl. Uh, Andrews. What was I about to say? No. Later. I can't. I'm so sorry. What? Give me one second. Because I can't. Um, he used to do my anchor charge for me. I was going to say my husband, but y'all already know that situation. Uh, yeah. So right now I am Stealing transition. But you see this anchor charge at all? I made this. Pretty cool, huh? It actually looks like real money. All I did was cut it out so I could show them a real life, like look alike. Mmm, the bland denimies. But it's okay because it was supposed to come down anyway for the end of the year. Um, yeah. ASMR, baby. <laughs> Let me stop. We went and got some popcorn in here. Now my room smells like popcorn. <sighs> I can't have too much for myself. What's the matter? What happened? That's because you need a USB-C charger. They're all in that bucket over over there. In there? In that the Over there. It's right there. Hey guys, I got Maya. Helping me sit to wait the classroom. See how she's flipping everything. What do I? You have a pin needle? My keys ain't going. Where are my scissors, Brittany? Me, them kids. I'm gonna just use this. All right, guys, I'm sorry. So, I'm gonna keep you here for this therapy session of me. Oh my God. <laughs> Warn somebody, please. I thought I did. Oh, no. <laughs> okay, Whew. Lord, sorry y'all. It's me running from it while I pop it to it all right. I mean, what's in one of them? It's like super heavy. I think well, it's just weigh it down and then it's all over the place. Water stain. I'm not sure what my friends are doing. And I feel like it's unfair to like kind of dump on them. 
that I'm trying to go somewhere even though they're not prepared. So, dolly dolly. I know. Just the skyscrapers go like. But he's nice and friendly, so he's not gonna do nothing. We're passing Lincoln Terrace, Lincoln Terrace Park. I didn't know there's a baseball field here. City got money, y'all. I've been to Lincoln Terrace Park before. When? Um, it was like February 23rd when I came from the doctor because my doctor's around Rochester. Oh, she over here using landmark name, y'all. She said Rochester, Rochester, and what? And. I don't know where that's going. I got to go down there. Down there. I guess that's a good enough location for us, huh? Yeah. Yeah, I have so much history in this park. Did you know my... Um, don't tell me nothing that's personal on camera. No. Tell my YouTube. What? Did you know my skin is spreading now? Don't say that. And we're going to figure it out, okay? Okay. You, me, and Avino, right? Yeah. This is a playground I've been to. Me too, I've been there. I think it looks a lot better than what it is to in the past. Yeah. Mm -hmm. They build it up. Yeah, they fix it up. Yeah. Yeah. That's pretty cool. We're um hanging out a little right now. We're really walking home. It's a long, long way. No yeah. wonder I stayed skinny. Bee. Living in New York. <laughs> you see the bee? I do see the bee. And when I first came back, I was super opposed to coming back and stay in New York. But now, and it's not that long, you know? When are you going back to New York Sunday? New York or Texas? Texas. I am going back on Sunday. Sunday morning, bright and early. Yeah. Oh. So now let me get you back now, I'm tired. <laughs> oh God. It's a lie. Eh? Is that your Jeep? No, we gotta reach already? Yeah. <laughs> you wanna show them my outfit? Hold on. This is her outfit, so she's wearing a flower dress and a white t-shirt and some beautiful shoes. Mm. <laughs> Thank you, honey. Some what shoes? You guys, schools in upstate New York? Beautiful. Who told me to go to a CUNY school, child? Should have been right up here in SUNY Oswego. Look at this lounge area. Popping. Can you imagine coming in here to study? Gossip. I had that time. Period in my life, that's what I was doing. The study. Hmm. Hmm. So cool. How you doing? I 
observation day, you guys. It is my last one for the year. Next semester, I should only have, or next year, I should only have one observation. And I'm happy. I'm happy. But I'm also not prepared because they were going to start testing in my room. And um, let's just say it's not up to par, but it'll be all right. Good morning. Beautiful morning. Beautiful morning. How y'all doing? <laughs> all right. Well, I'm going to see my school and we're going to try to make this work. Okay. All right, guys, I already had my um, observation. It was in the morning. Sorry, I'm looking at my camera. Um, hey, y'all, I already had my observation. It was in the morning. It was good as usual. Actually, about the play Monopoly money, I passed it out, but then I was like, ooh, friends are irresponsible. So as soon as he left, I picked it up. I don't even know if I'm going to do it with this class. <laughs> um, This is how my class looks at the moment. He actually came in very early, and I was just like, <laughs> I was doing this anchor chart uh, to represent what we're doing right now. We're talking about financial literacy or spending, saving. And he saw me on the board drawing the anchor chart chat. It was super ghetto, but he didn't seem to be like bothered by it. My kids were eating their breakfast and then they automatically got in character. Everybody was good today, even the one that was bugging out last time. Um, and everything is good as gold now he said i got two more observations next fall i know for six i thought it was only five but it's six i guess when so he said i got two more next year that he's gonna come and see and based on his recommendations i'm gonna have a new class so that should be a lot different this is all that's in my room right now i keep like kind of turning you on and then off of it but this is all that's left in my room I grouped them up because we were going to be doing collaborative work. I don't have any handouts, and they're using their Texas Go Math books. And that's about it. Like, my little PowerPoint thing in the chicken is really good, too. Um, let me show you. Pretty cool. There wasn't even that many slides, and we didn't get through all of them, but so far, so good. Okay, I'm super excited. This teaching journey has been bittersweet but it's okay